Resident Evil 2. So last time I was on, I believe we got the part we needed for the jail or the, the door panel. That is going to be a lot of fun because um, there was a lot of zombies in here and they're going to probably break out and cause some mischief when I do this. But I get the card for here, I think. Yeah, 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 it's the way out. So that'll give me the way out, which is good. Um, but before we go there and before shit inevitably kicks off when I go to do that, I think I believe I mentioned last time, I don't know if I'll include it in the edit, but um, there are rooms that apparently, I think, since they're in red, it says currently searching. I think that means there's stuff in these rooms I haven't gotten yet. We will also probably go through the generator room and kill the dogs and stuff, because that was something else we missed out on. So, But first, what we're going to do is we are going to deal with all of the things we missed on inside the police station before we go to the basement. So this is going to be a lot of dodging the big guy, <laughs> basically. And then when I get to that side, it's going to be dodging the big guy and not pissing off the liquor. So, this is a fantastic idea. Now, oh, I still hear that dog. But that's the dog that's down here, exactly. That's where the dog is. Now, in the last time I was on this, I was doing a lot of listening and trying to pinpoint where he is before I go out there. About... 60% of the time I did that, it didn't help. I would walk out and then I was totally wrong on where he was, so... I'm gonna have to get over this anxiety around this big Mr. Thumpy Thump, who I kinda want to call Mr. Swole. I kinda like Mr. Swole, so... We're gonna go with Mr. Swole. We need to get over this anxiety of him. He is very scary and very noisy. But he's not very fast. I can't avoid him. He may scare the shit out of me if I don't know where he is, but... Everything's going to do that at some point. Oh, there's an alive zombie in here. Oh yeah, because you came through the window, didn't you? Because I don't have boards. Yeah, that's an issue. Okay, let's deal with that issue. Oh, hey, back up. Okay, so this, this place is not going to be safe for very long, this break room, because I don't have boards to deal with this situation. Whoa! Chill out, Leon! Just a zombie. That was just a knife. Good job I caught that. I didn't throw a fucking grenade at myself. Uh, no! Bad zombie! Okay, there we go. Zombie dealt with. Ah! Not dealt with. I wanted my... I want, oh, God fucking damn it, really? Oh, my supplies I gathered, you fucker. Okay, yeah, right, cool. That was... Ugh. So, I think I missed something in here, apparently. Yep, I know about you. Stop making so much fucking noise, please. Mr. Swole's about looking to tap some ass. Um, mine, apparently. Oh, I apparently walked past the bullets. I just It just popped up in the map just now. Is that zombie guarding them? I think he is. Excuse me, sir. May I have those bullets? Don't bite me. Cool. I'm just going to go down to the gar the downstairs because I don't think... I don't think at this point I'm meant to know. I, I don't really can't really think of anything. So... Yeah. And I don't know, there's probably some bullets or something like lying on the floor there, but the liquor's there and I don't have to go back. So, yeah, I'm going back on my plan. I'm sorry, guys, but uh, I will try the generator room, though. That is something I will try. But now we need to go back to the break room. So that's back this way. Back the way I came. Fantastic. So, we made it. I haven't actually heard Mr. Swole in, like, quite a long time. So, don't know what's going on there, but... Maybe he's down in the basement. Maybe that's why I've not heard from him in a while. Well, either way, I'm going to go save. I've gotten some stuff. I haven't checked out all the areas because I just, I don't think it's going to work out. And I can't think. It's the Scott guy's name. I haven't figured that out yet. 
It doesn't necessarily mean I've missed it. It just maybe means I haven't figured that out yet. Because, to be honest, I don't like we still haven't got the heart key. And that's my thinking is that I haven't got the heart key yet. So I'm going to be coming back up here at some point to open all the heart doors, and there are a few of them. So clearly we're not done in the police station yet. And, oh, we're going to be fighting some dogs, eh? I forgot about that. Um, just magnum and pistol, right? Let's see. Maybe I can just sneak up on the first dog and knife him a little. Just a little bit. Hopefully enough to take him down, but we'll see. Probably not. I'll probably just get myself killed. I do have plenty of health though, so... Okay. There's a bad pooch on the other side of this door. Bad, bad poochie. Hey. Hello. How close were you again? I forgot. I think you were pretty close. Maybe I should just... Like, fuck the charades that's gonna happen here and just magnum. I feel like that is overkill. So I actually don't know how much damage these things take. Okay. Let's try this idea. How, how durable is the knife right now? They're not both not great, but he doesn't see us. We can use that to our advantage. Or I'm just going to make things... It. Leon, sh shut the fuck up. <laughs> That's gonna suck. Oh, it is. Yes, I know. Don't be so fucking negative, though. Why am I just... Theon, what are you doing? Why are you just insulting this dog right behind it? So... <laughs> Did I do it? Fuck me, it was two knife slashes. And I haven't alerted the rest of them. Oh, may have spoke too soon. I heard barking. They weren't barking before. Wait, are those ones in the cages still in the cages? I didn't think about that. Well, either way, that went weirdly well. So, if we can, we should do that again. The music's kicking up for some reason. It's this hole. I think these holes is how the dogs travel between areas to fucking kill me. I just don't know why this music's kicking up. Fuck you. Stop swearing at the dogs, Leon. It's for one... It, Leon, stop it. For one, it's not very sneaky. Two, it's not very nice. What the hell is going on? The dog is not going to tell you what's going on, Leon. Just stab him. Do this. Are you encouraging yourself or the dog? I don't know. <laughs> That might have alerted something. The music certainly thinks so. No? Okay. Operation Ninja is going well so far. So there's clearly must still be some dogs in the area. It's where though. Is it the ones in here? Are the ones in here out? I'll find out in a second. You guys are still in your cages. Oh, that one isn't. Hello. I'm just going to close the door on you. All right. I don't think I can come from behind me. Ah, and I'll knife you. I'll knife you. I'm ready. Leon's got a shank in hand ready. Come at me. I know you can travel through vents. Come through that vent and come at me. I've figured you out, doggos. Doggos? Okay, maybe I haven't figured you out yet. Doggo. Doggo, what's happening? Do you want? Do I have to come to you? Oh Christ, he's at the door. Maybe he's about as scared of me as I am of him. Okay. Yeah! Ah, oh, no, that's not how this works. That's not how this works, doggo. Don't worry, I've got a spare knife. Come here. Come here, dog! Okay, right, fuck this shit. Oh my god. Okay! 
I think it's over. All right, okay, wow. I mean, okay, I did use some ammo there, but can I get my knife back or is that not a possibility? I think it. I think the knife went into the other side of the dog, so it's now officially underground. Okay, well, let's, we, let's not stab things anymore because that's a handy thing to get someone off of me. So, and this, this knife is not very durable, so. Let's uh, not do the stabbing for a while. Uh, where, why were we down here? Ah, yes, I remember now. We were going to get this gunpowder, and I kind of wanted to play with the generator because I was under the impression that um, there's a door here that's got a red light above it, and when we last played with the generator, we turned this one's red light green. So I'm wondering if maybe we can open whatever that door is for more goodies. It's possibly just the gunpowder I missed, but we'll see. Yeah, it was just the gunpowder, but... Let's go look at this generator. No, I don't think so. Okay, so maybe not then. Unless it's one of those puzzles where it's like... <laughs> you do the optional thing first, then do the thing you're meant to do. Or else you get locked out of the optional thing. I hope that's not the case. I've. What is it did that? Um, there's something that did that. I played something recently where... There was a puzzle where there was a thing where you could... What, what was it? Oh my god, I'm really blanking. I'm sure I'm sure something like that happened to me. It's, I can't remember what it was. Okay, never mind. That's It can't be that important if my brain's gotten rid of it, but then my brain gets rid of important things constantly. My brain doesn't work right. Just, whatever. <laughs> I'm over it. You guys get over it. <laughs> I'm over it. I was over it years ago. So don't do anything yet, game. I, I just... I'm going to... Like, I don't care what you do, unless you physically stop me from doing it, I'm going down this ladder. Yeah. I'm going down this ladder to save the game. Let me do this. Okay. Yay! I made it. Is there anything down here now? Is there a big... There is a dude I ran into. What happened with him? Yeah, he fell down there. What was that about? The game hasn't really brought him up again. I totally forgot about that. I never thought it would happen, but I'm okay on ammo. It is... We're having a very weird day today. There's still a space on my D-pad for a gun. I wonder I wonder what the game will also give me. So we have... I think we have parts for the jail cell. I don't know if it's all the parts I need, but I have a couple. So we'll see how much progress we can make with just these two in the meantime. Tell you one thing for sure, we're gonna get bum rushed. Yep, we are gonna have a party when this place opens up. But good job I have a magnum now. I might actually just magnum it just to save the fucking hoo ha. This place is absolutely full of zombies. So, yeah, this place is going to kick off when I do this, so... But I'm just going to magnum it, because fuck, fuck them. Fuck them and their zombie shite. I hope the big man isn't, uh... Mr. Swole isn't, like, sitting back there again. I haven't, I haven't seen or heard Mr. Swole in a long time. A good little while. So I hope he's not just camping behind that wall. Waiting to fist my face. Right, so... Use. And use... Ooh, it's a, it's a puzzle. Oh, I can puzzle. Sure. Oh, yeah. Yay! We have power. You're not going to get up right because, you know, Mr. Swole uh, squ squished your head. Oh, hey, he's got, an, he's got a memo. It's Ben. The station's swarming with monsters. Even here I can hear their cries, but it's not the zombies I'm afraid of. Codename, Tyrant. The ultimate bioweapon developed by those bastards in utmost secrecy. To think that there might be a thing wandering around here. Chances are they've ordered it to wipe out the witnesses. Oh! So that's why Mr. Swole's here. He's been sent by... Well, from what I know from the previous Resident Evil games, it's probably Umbrella. Huh? Yeah, but that doesn't explain the rumors about the orphanage. 
I, I just find it way too coincidental Umbrella is one of the benefactors. You told me this interview was about the new scholarship Umbrella set up. <laughs> Come on, Linda. Nobody cares about that. They want to know about the G-Virus. Where did you hear about this? And that big fucking sinkhole in the city, which, by the way, rumor has it goes straight to your underground lab. Now, are yeah. you going to talk to me, or are you going to... This interview is over. <laughs> Okay, right. So we can get out. Hmm. What are they after? So we we have opened this door. We may have opened some other ones too. Hey. Yeah, that isn't good. All right, let's get ready. You guys come to me, cause my my aim is now steady. Hello. Oh my God, there's a lot of you. That's one. That's two. If I just take my. Oh my goodness. Okay, you know what? No thanks. That's way too many for me to shoot. My aim is not that good. There we go. Oh, there's even more. Oh my god, they keep coming. How many is there? Oh, he's going into jail cell. He doesn't want to be out. He just wants to go back to jail. Because he knows what's waiting for him. My magnum. But actually, you know what? He might be the last one. Maybe. He doesn't look very keen to fight. He's probably the smartest in the lot. He probably just seen this pile and went, Oh god, no, I'm not doing that. Oh, I hit him. Oh, there. Oh, you back up again. Oh, fantastic. Go back down, please. Take it. There we go. That was a bit of a buzz shot, but... Okay. Okay, that's great and all. I just killed a bunch of zombies and I actually somehow still have ammo. That's great. Cool. Whatever. That's a pile of bodies. I, I, I don't remember which ones I shot good and which ones I shot bad. And pr pretty much most of them were a grenade. <laughs> I don't know what's alive in there. Ah, shit. Okay. So this is going to be nerve-wracking. Right. Guaranteed these cells have something in them. Or at least a couple of them do. Oh yeah, yeah. He, oh, he's he's pushing all the bodies out of the way, so someone was alive in there. I knew it. Oh, is he done? Is is anyone else alive in there? Do I have to start What was that noise? What was that noise? What did I just hear? Was that me? I don't know. Do I have to start shanking in this pile? Okay, let's start shanking. Good. Shank away. Shanking. Cool. No dead bodies in there. Down there looks clear. The music is still kicked up, so... I don't know what that's about. What's this do? Well, that opens that way. I don't know what's that way. I want to. I want to check these first. I'm pretty sure at least one of these is going to have something in them. As intense as the music is right now, I need stuff. I like stuff, and I want stuff. Plus, we we had all those. N Whoa! Oh, God, wasn't expecting that. Okay, never mind. Was not expecting that. Wow, I thought I hadn't heard you in a while. Well, I guess I guess we're figuring out where this goes. I guess I'm not. I guess I'm not getting to look around then. Fuck you, Mr. Swole. Oh, my yeah. God. No! Mr. Swole's coming. Please get out of my shit. We need to get away from Mr. Swole. Or wait, no, his name's Tyrant, isn't he? Tyrant, okay. Oh, okay, well, I just cannot get away from this motherfucker. Oh, well, I'm dead. 
Mr. Swole just got Mr. Smushed. <laughs> <coughs> not so swole now, are you? <coughs> Bitch. Oh, not you, the, the Mr. Swole. Old. Saving your ass, that's twice. I didn't realize you were keeping score. Look, this isn't a game. Nothing dies down here. You have the key card. Yeah. And this. I was hoping you could explain what's on it. Maybe. After I hear it. Let's get out of here. Oh, hey, oh ho! I have a person to hang out with. Hello. Hey, you Ada. Want to open the shutter? Well, yeah, okay, chill out. I'm getting there. Now, hold on. Hold, hold the fucking phone. We just annihilated Mr. Swole. Can I, can I go back and check those jails? Actually, no. You know what? I've already established... Plus, it actually it says there's nothing in them there, but... I've already established we are coming back here. Okay, I, 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 chill out! I'm doing it. Yeah, we've already established that I'm probably going to be coming back here because I don't have a red uh, heart key, so... We'll be back. If I want to, I can... If I'm passing by, I can have a look. Let's see where the game takes us now. Right, slow down. There's stuff to pick up. Oh, she's eager. Jesus. I wish I really still had that grenade. Oh, she's listening to that thing. Is that the intel you needed? Unfortunately, no. Ben didn't come through. Well, what exactly are you looking for? More info on the people responsible for this mess. What about you? Trying to save the world? I told Lieutenant Brenna I'd bring help. Good luck getting that. We are in the streets now. This is interesting. Ooh. I think there'd be more zombies. Why is this place all... Ooh. Under construction. Apparently that's a gun shop. Can I go in there first? Before... Out. Yeah. Going through that gun shop looks like the only way. Oh, I was already planning to go in there before we did anything else, so... I'm... Don't worry, I'm happy with this. Ladies first. You didn't give me the chance to be right away. Oh, hello. Oh, you pick locks. You're a rogue. Thank you. What a mess. I hope there's guns in this mess. Oh. Oh, 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 don't. Oh. 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 Yeah. It did it just put it just put ammo in my shotgun. <laughs> Thank you. <gasps> the grenade I just lost. Oh, you you stay right there. I have... Mm, 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 there's stuff in here. Oh, yes. Oh, 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 yes. Ammo. Um, oh, I am so happy. Ammo. Um, oh, what is this? Letter to the shopkeeper. Kendo, it seems like you've got your reasons for staying put, so I'll trust you to take care of yourself. Still, if things get worse on... And your other arrangements don't work out. You know where to come find me. I'll do everything I can. Jill Valentine. That's a character I've seen in one of the games. Jill Valentine. And she's in one of the movies as well. Because I've seen the Resident Evil movies. And she's in one of them. But then so is Mia Djukovic. Mia... I don't know her... What? I don't know her name. I'm not gonna hurt you. I said don't move. I'm just passing through. I'm gonna ask you to lower that weapon. I kill you are. You gotta turn around and go right back out the way you came in. I think your daughter needs help, sir. Don't 
tell me how to deal with my daughter. Drop it. No! Wait! Step aside. We need to terminate her before she turns. Terminate? It's my fucking daughter. Ada. Just let them be. Emma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. Daddy? Yeah, Daddy's here. Okay. Those fucking things outside. <laughs> what they did to us. You're a cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? She was our sweet little angel. Mommy. I'm sleeping, honey. Okay. And I'm gonna put you to bed, too, okay? Emma. privacy. You know, it's one thing to keep the truth from me, but why him? I want to find out what's happening here and stop whoever's behind it. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. We may not make it out. Whatever it takes to save this city, count me in. Oh, Leon is all in. Man, that... Oh, God, that sucks. Man, that really sucks. I always hate when you see those people online who are always like, oh man, I can't wait, I'm so ready for like a zombie apocalypse to get started. I'm like, dude, seriously? No, you don't want that. That's not a good thing. Shit like that has to happen, and that's fucking horrible. No? Okay. You did say give us some privacy. I was just wondering if we could maybe go and see that everything's okay. Heard it's, well, Umbrella Corporation? it's not okay. They're a pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. <laughs> yes, it certainly does, Leon. <laughs> I don't know why you said it like that, but yes. That explains the horrible things I've seen. It's like, yes, you have seen some horrible things, Leon. Thank you for the commentary. And that's why I'm looking for Annette Birkin. She's the one at Umbrella responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. Okay. Well, Leon's all in for this. He's down to take down some, some Umbrella and their fucking bullshit. Doing all this crazy shit to the city. Where are we going? Oh my god, this we're going. We get to Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Well said. After you. Gee, thanks. Yeah, thanks. Uh, I love going first. Can't imagine a real scientist being down here. According to HQ, this leads right into Umbrella's secret facility. Come on. Sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? Welcome to corporate America. Umbrella's controlled Raccoon City for years. Ugh. I remember this from a movie as well. There's like a big, cool, like, fucking, like, I don't know. Uh, what was the word the guy used for? Big sinkhole under the city, yeah. There's like a big facility underneath, like, Raccoon City. That's in the movie. It's, like, huge, because the movie's... Well, that's the first movie, Jesus. I think it's... That earthquake? Sure as hell hope so. That was a very noisy noise. Uh oh. That is not an earthquake. 
Holy. What the hell? God only knows what's down here. A fucking monster? The fuck was that? It's big. It's really big. Thank <laughs> you.